Um, fire copter, fire helicopter depots over here. What we could do is have some tank reservoirs. The tank reservoir is a water reservoir in uh, if you the city pumps more water than it needs, the excess is stored in the tanks. If the pump if a pump fails or you need or the need for water rises, the tank will give out water. The reservoir automatically supplies the city if the water is need is greater than the production must be connected to the water pipes so we could do something like this um, and this will hopefully I don't know actually whether we really need it I don't think we do um, that should have provided us with enough uh, water if we um, run out again. But then again, we're creating enough electricity. I think what I'll do is I will turn some of these off. Because they're not needed anymore. We'll keep them just in case we need to um, use them again. But for now, they'll stay off. And we're creating enough electricity with things like this and the uh, water, the dam, to um, hopefully provide enough. Uh, not enough workers. Why don't these have enough workers? And wow, that's a lot of traffic. And it's all stuck behind a bus. Just finish boarding, for goodness sake. <laughs> there we go. Oh my gosh, we got a uh, fire raising in hell. That's not good. And what is the... Um, we have more oil back here which we could use. I don't particularly want to. What I guess I could do is possibly have a highway road come off from here, which will turn and connect up there. And we can finally get rid of all of this. And possibly... Um, bring this in somewhere else. Say, over here or something. Um, or it could just connect up here. I think that should be fine. Let's see here. If we try, this should be a road with nothing on it actually. Just try that and I'll upgrade these other ones back to it. Let's see how that does. So this is a cargo terminal as well. It should be producing quite a lot of uh, traffic but it isn't it's it's all coming down to this one which i kind of don't have a problem with but at the same time it's causing quite a lot of uh, strain on our roads <clears throat> which is a little bit annoying um one thing we could do is possibly maybe uh Bring this, oh, bring this down here, so it's in more of a central position, and um, hopefully that should help out a little bit. All this traffic is just 
trying to get onto this, um, get to this, this thing, which is ridiculous. And then where's it going? It's all coming up here. To go where? Exactly. Bob's plastic bags. All these fire trucks are just trying to get through. Oh my goodness. To get up to here. Wow. Um, didn't realize we had such a problem up here. Um, okay. Well, one thing I could do is build a, another cargo terminal over here. Um, my hope is that that will help bring a lot of the traffic over this way away from this busy junction down here because it looks like that's mainly what the problem is at this stage um, don't really know what to do about all this because it's just it's, it's so much traffic everything can't cope with it I guess one thing I could possibly do is take out the oil well here and replace it maybe with, say, logging or something. Um, but I don't really see how that would really solve many of the issues that we've got going on here. Um, oh, I don't know. I don't know what to do. Um, is this just normal? This is just normal, isn't it? The real cereal. Why so cereal? Um, I don't know. I'm no, not now. <laughs> I'm not sure I understand. Shut up. Yeah, I don't know what to do really about um, all this traffic because I don't think it's going to flow no matter what I do at this stage. <clears throat> so it's a little bit annoying, but it's just because we're super successful. That's the only problem with it. could do is upgrade that road the other way around so that then it can do two lane all the way down the game is uh, struggling here all the trucks are going super slow I don't know why oh my goodness what's happening with this power You have power. Why can't the power get to you? What's that about? Oh, not again. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Right. Nope. Nope, so much nope. When was that autosave? 20 minutes ago. Right about when I turned off all the power. 
that was a huge issue that we had and I didn't realise I didn't realise the power had gone out. <sighs> That's the problem with turning off those damn uh, uh, power plants for using coal and stuff. If you turn them off then if anything happens to the actual power supply then everything can go wrong. I think what I'm going to have to do is build a second pylon out. I think this is the only way I can uh, protect my electrical supply. Just to bring it over here and this way in. That should hopefully stop anything else from uh, going completely tits up because that was that was terrible um, it shouldn't have done that but it did and um, there's not a lot I can do about it other than reverting back to the save like I have so hopefully we won't have to worry about that again it does mean that we've still got all this up here um, I have an idea, and it may sound a little bit crazy, but we're going to have two, wet, two lane road coming off of here, so if we take the high capacity ones with this sort of road off of here, take it down to here, and then if we do a loop back, then hopefully it will work a little bit better than this is currently, because this was pretty uh, last, last minute, it wasn't really thought out. Um, so we'll do uh, 6 unit by 5 unit because that's not going to fit 5 unit by 6 unit back straight line up to here and then a line in like that and hopefully that will now all flow a little bit better because it will be all coming out of this junction and um, we'll see. We'll see how that does. We'll change this uh, lane so that both lanes can turn left as well. And let's turn off these now that the uh, other power's on from the um, from the dam. That should be giving us more than enough power. We don't need these on. That's one less load of traffic that has to come up here, which will be good. I think I might just take out this junction, because if they all have to come out here, then nothing will be using it as a cut through, and that's really where the problem is, is that they're using it as a cut through, and they shouldn't be. So. I'll do a straight line up to here. Fill this in with industrial, and hopefully, I mean we've got a problem with the bus line there, but that's that's absolutely fine. Don't really care about the bus line. What I care about is all this traffic getting to where it needs to go. 